I'll be comparing an iPad Air to a Nook HD Plus. Both are 16 gigabyte models. And what, I, what you'll find interesting is that they're basically the same dimensions. Kind of surprising, isn't it? Um, we'll look at the controls and how they're situated. On the Nook, there's just a volume. I mean, oh, here's the Nook. There's a power button on the side, whereas on the uh, iPad Air, you have the volume control and the rotate lock. And then over here, for some reason, Nook decided to put the volume controls on the top, right next to the headphone. Power button on the iPad Air is on the top right. And over here is the uh, headphone jack for the iPad Air. And on the side over here, there's nothing. And on the very bottom, I think this is for the SD card slot. I've never used it. So one of the nice things that you have with the Nook HD Plus is you have expandable memory. Whereas on the iPad, you're pretty limited to what's on board. And the iPad Air uses the lightning connector. And the Nook HD just uses its proprietary connector. Both are pretty expensive, but now you can get these ones, generic ones, for like a dollar or two dollars, just the cable. The cable for this, you can't find a generic one. So, the other thing is, you look at the back. Simple designs on the back. This one's plastic, whereas this is like a brush metal. Aluminum. There is no camera. This one sports a 5 megapixel camera on the iPad Air, but there's no camera on the Nook HD. Again, this retails for 150 This retails for 500 so, both have home buttons, based essentially. This is their home button over here. And this is the home button for the Nook. Uh, both are HD displays. Where, whereas uh, the iPad Air is a retina display, supposedly. Uh, this one is just, I think, a 1080p display. I could be wrong. It might be better. But it's not as good as the iPad Air. I don't have the specific specs on it. So I just wanted to compare some basic stuff. This is a 9-inch display versus the almost 10-inch display of the iPad Air. And when you compare weight, they're, they feel roughly the same iPad Air might be is probably slightly lighter but it's hard to tell. Again, if you look at the width, you can tell that the Nook HD is much a little thicker, maybe twice twice the size, twice as thick. But does it make a difference? No, it's actually easy. It's both are very easy to carry, so not a big issue. So the first thing I wanted to try is 